Hello and welcome to Loving TV. In today's episode, we'll be continuing my Girls Marvel League career mode. I hope you enjoy. So, today we'll be doing the triathlon and uh, Snowball's currently in the League of the Championship. Let's see our Rangers, Warsaw Cast, and us with the main uh, championship uh, contenders. So, the triathlon is parts a road like Marvel 1, let's fit does like Marvel Rally, and then there's some underwater parts right at the end. So as we watch uh, the demo run, as they go through uh, the road area, through the dirt, and now into the water, which takes the longest. And the yellow marble will take the win here. So the blue just about creeps uh, in second, yeah. Okay, so first seat team member is Shining Storm Snowballs. I've been there with Snowballs Championship leaders and our main rivals so far. Snowballs in the lead of this race. I think they should take it unless they have a really poor underwater, which they don't. But they get overtaken and they won't win the heat. They'll come in second in their heat. But they just overtake the Midnight Wisp on the line with Team Momo and uh, Shining Swarm uh, being eliminated. Snowballs so winning their heat. Next, we're up against uh, Green Lux. Thunderbolts and the Limers. So we uh, go into last position, but hopefully we can uh, get closer to the other marbles. As the Thunderbolts are going very slowly out of that corner, and hopefully we can uh, go and take them as we overtake them. But I think also the Green Ducks overtook. As, as oh, that's very close, and we actually do get through. Lyra's winning the heat ahead of uh, <clears throat> ahead of us. Uh, we both go through Green Ducks and Thunderbolts. Next, Melio, Savage Speeders, Hazers, and Orangers. Orangers, a very large championship contender. As the Melios take uh, a large lead, and. Uh, they will go in the water first, and it's very close between the Arrangers and Hazers. That's something that's to look out for. But the Hazers nearly go to a stop, as I think that's all Rajah Racers nearly taking the win there. It was actually the Savage Speeders. So it was Melian and Savage Speeders with the Arrangers getting knocked out. Bad event for them. Rajah Racers, Balls of Curse, Cobalts, and Oceanics. Balls of Chaos, a championship contender, and they immediately fall to last position. Isn't a very looking very good for them. As we see, um, I think the sh uh, Midnight Wisp take the lead into the water with Balls of Chaos in last position. As they're absolutely going super fast in the water, they went from last to fourth, a uh, second, I mean. So, Team Mobile win last. Then the Hazers, Shining Storm, O Rangers in first in bad map for them. Rise of Races, Thunderbolts, Cobalts, and Green Ducks. Next, we're up against Limers, uh, Midnight Wiss, and Snowballs, who have been our biggest rivals so far in this season. As we are able to slot into uh, third position, our aim is just to get through into second, and that will mean we will go uh, into the finals. I think. As we slot in right behind the snowball and are able to overtake the snowballs. And we're going really, really, really fast through the water. And we, I think, take the win in this round. Event, uh, round. Yeah, we do ahead of the limers. Us two, uh, top two in in the same heats. Midnight Wisps and snowballs. Next, Melio, Sammy Sweeters, Oceanic, and Balls of Chaos. Balls of Chaos uh, Championship contender and they are in the lead. So we see Savage Speeders game really close up to them, but they accidentally push them on a bit. But they are very close. Let's see who gets the better walls apart. I think it's the Balls of Chaos going very, very fast, but the Savage Speeders nearly overtaking the Oceanics, but the Oceanics. Keeping it strong in the wall, so balls of chaos and oceanic, top two, savage trees and mellow yellow. We've knocked out mellow yellow. 
and I'm snuggles and seven midnight with six and savage speed is fair. Now, both us and Walls of Chaos are two championship contenders. So keep the eye out uh, your eye out for us. As uh, we are in third Walls of Chaos taking the lead. And we nearly overtake the uh, Oceanics. They're just about to able to hold on. And they actually get speed boosted by us. As we get a brilliant water entry. We're absolutely speeding in the water. I actually think we might take the win. But the Oceanics just on the line. I'm not sure actually who went first. Spores of Chaos trundling in fourth position. Let's see. Oceanics just pipped us on the line by 0.089 seconds. This means Oceanics take uh, a win. Then the us, um, Limers and Balls of Chaos. So as you can see, Oceanics and uh, us and Limers on the podium. Oceanics jumping all the way up into the championship lead from out of nowhere. We are able to climb one point behind them. And one point behind us is the Snowballs, then Balls of Chaos and O-Rangers. Thunderbolts, Mellow Yellow, Green Ducks, Midnight Wrist, Cobalt, Savage Speeders, Team Limer, Limers, Hazers, Shining Swamp and Raspberry Races. <clears throat> now it's time for the steeplechase. So, so in the steeplechase, all you have to do is you have to go through the course without hitting any of the steeples. Every time you hit a steeple you get a time uh, penalty and you have to try and complete it fastest without getting any penalty. So a penalty adds on a second. So first team is Team Momo. They hit, well, most of them at the start. Getting 22.51 time there, saying the benchmark. Shining Swarm will go now. They hit the first one, but now able to dodge the second one. They hit a couple more. Come through the line with 21.16. Snowball's championship uh, in third in the championship. They hit a couple very early. As they get a 20.70. Putting them in the lead next Midnight Wisps. They hit a couple. As one of them actually goes around and hits one, pushing them down into fourth. Not a very good strategy there. Getting five penalties. Next, Limers. Limers uh, hitting one very early, but I able to avoid the rest. So they go into the lead with 18.99. We're up next. Now let's see. Can we get a good run? We hit one. Or we're able to dodge another and then we hit one. As we slot in with a 20.58 second position so far. Next, Green Ducks. As they come in fifth with 21.66. Thunderbolts next. They go and they go in third just behind us so far. So as it stands, we are in second behind the Limers. So just watch out for uh, if anyone gets second or first, because that means we will be pushed down. But I don't think the Mellow Yellow are going to do it. It's a very poor one for them, it's putting them in ninth in last position. Next, Savage Speeders. See, they go in seventh. Haze is up now. As they slot in in eighth. Bow Rangers, another championship contender. They will go and they get a second position push, pushing us into third. And with only a few marbles left to go, Rise for Races up next. They go into third, pushing us back as well. So we're currently in fourth position. 
we'll look at an, another championship uh, contender. They are going very fast, but they smash into that one at the end, costing them a little bit. Next, Cobalt. And that's pretty good for them going in fast. Very good for them. Finally, Championship leaders Oceanics. Let's see what they can do. They go in first, so as we see, Malaga, Midnight Wist, Team Mamo, Hazes, Savage Speeds, Green Ducks, Balls of Chaos, Shining Swarm, Snowballs, Thunderbolts, we're in sixth. Rise Races, O Rangers, Oceanics, Limers, and Cobalts take the win. So as we see the championship, nothing changes in the top six. So it's Oceanics, Us, Snowballs, Balls of Chaos, O Rangers, Thunderbolts. Cobalt's moving up into 7th, Green Duck staying in 8th, Limers going up into 9th, Melo in 10th, Green Duck West in 11th, uh, Savage Speeders, Team Momo, Hazel, Shining Swan and Risen Races in last position. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Remember to like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!